Hey again, it's Zach. Hey, and it's me here. And in this quick tutorial, we're going to show you how to put score in your game. Uh, so first thing we're going to do, as always, is show you how the game's going to look by the end of the tutorial. And then we're just going to go ahead and put score in. All right, let's get started. So I'm going to run the game. And you see that it looks about the way it ended the last tutorial, except I'm going to go get a diamond. And you see here, it says my score is 5. You get another diamond, my score is 10. So at every diamond, my score is increasing by five. And now I'm going to go finish the level. This time I say, I get a message. That Congratulations says, on beating the level. Right. And now my score is up to 50 because I got a 25 point bonus for beating that level. And I'm getting five points for all these diamonds. And I'm going to go finish this level. So that 25 should put me at 105, which is what my score is. Oh, snap. And now I can put my name into the Zach. high score has number one on here. That's amazing. Cool, so we've shown you what it's gonna look like and let's get started. Um, so first thing we're gonna do is uh, just open up where we left uh, last time. And we want to add a score every time we get a diamond. So we remember that we already made diamonds and an event where we collected them. So we just wanna give us five points. So we go into this score tab so Game Maker has a built-in score tab and, and score variable, so it's really easy to use. Um, all you do is over here you see that set score button, just drag it in, drop it, um, and just set what you want the new score to be. So for the diamonds I want five points, and I want to check relative. Why, why relative? And that means that the score is actually increasing by five, not just being set to five. Because if I didn't check relative, every time I got a diamond my score would be set to five, but in oh, this okay. case... It's going 5, 10, 15, etc. So let's run that and let's test it to make sure we get five points for all the diamonds. Here we go. First diamond. Hey, we have five. Nice. We have five points and another diamond and ten points. So we've done our diamond score. Now I want to give 25 points for every time I finish a level. So remember when you hit the goal, that's when you get, that's when you finish the level. So I want to go to my score. I want to drag this set score again. And I think we said 25. Yeah. And we're going to make that relative. Remember to check relative. And remember also that we had a message every time we did the game. So I want to go to main two. And you see this message. Thing. So I'm going to drag it into here, and let's display a message. Congratulations on being the level. Click OK. And you remember that we had this go to next room if the next room exists. And we want to have it do both of these things. So we go to this control. And you see these two triangles. And I want to drag this first triangle right here, and this next triangle right here. And so what that means is everything between these two triangles is going to happen if the next room exists. So if the next room exists, I display the message and go to the next room. And then the else, remember, ends the game. But I also want to then we have a We want to show a high score table, right? Right. So we use these triangles again, drag start, drag an end, and to show the high score we go into this score and we have this show high score and we're going to drag it before we end the game and have everything like that. So we've shown high score, the game's over, we display a message if the next level exists. Cool, so let's, let's just run it to make sure everything's working. Here I am, 5, 10, so we got the score. 15, 20, 25, cool. So when I get that, it should bump me up to 50, I think, because we have plus 25. Right. Cool, I beat we the level. The message, and we're and 50, my score is 50. So that works. Nice. 55, 60, should put me up to 80. And finishing the level should be at 105. 105. And you can put your name in the high Sweet. score. Sweet. We are tied, sir. We are tied. Great. So we have showed you how to add the bonus for finishing a level and how to show the high score. 
Great, and I think that covers it for this tutorial. Uh, next time we'll be around to tell you about uh, timers and how to do some cool stuff with your score. See ya.